Good afternoon, or uh, I guess it is afternoon, on a Sunday. How are you today? So my question for you today is, what is your exit strategy? Okay, I'm not being weird or gross or anything like that, you know, but the truth of the matter is where none of us are getting out of here alive, right? So we all, we have to figure out what we really want to do with our lives to make it the very best life that we can and have the kind of life that we want. Now, I am around, I'm getting older now, and so there are people in my life who are getting older and not able to do the things they were they used to be able to do. There's people that, in my life that people are starting to die, and it's really weird to be in my 50s and you just don't think. I mean, most of us go along in our lives, and when we're young especially, we figure that we're immortal, right? We're gonna live forever, nothing will ever happen to us. Well, when I got in my car accident when I was 43 years old, 44 years old, um, that was a really huge wake up call for me because I shouldn't have gotten out alive in that car accident. I shouldn't have. I'm super lucky and super grateful that I am still here. And I think that's why I've decided, that's a big reason why I've decided to share my videos with you every day because I want to inspire you to have the, the, the best life that you can and to not live every day just going from day to day to day doing the same thing every single day, especially those of you who have a job those of you who are getting up in the morning you get ready you go to a job you're 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 doing something for someone else's dreams right so you need to be working for yourself and in this world right now it is it's really almost impossible to have just one job and be able to have that freedom that life that you really want to live and is your money gonna run out before you do and the truth of the matter is also the chances are that now that we're getting up there and we're starting to get older, um, you know, we're probably going to live longer. Things are happening with uh, in the medical industry that's going to keep us alive longer. So we got to figure this out now. We have to figure out that we can't just keep going around doing the same thing, just doing one job or one business and just expecting that to support us until the day we die, right? So you want to figure out a way to have some multiple streams of income. There should You should never just count on one thing. So when I had my business and I got in my car accident, my business stopped. I, I, there was no more money because I was my business back then. I was tutoring out of my home and that was my business. And when I got hit by that truck, my business and my income stopped. So you really need to think about that. If you are one of the those people that are either in a job or you're in a business and you're the only one doing things and you don't have a strategy to keep your business going if something happens to you, you're in huge trouble. I just saw on my Facebook the other uh, yesterday that a chiropractor who is, he, that's what he does, he is a chiropractor just got in a horrible car accident and he possibly could lose a lot of the use of his hands. Okay, so what's going to happen to his business if he doesn't have other chiropractors or a, a plan or a strategy to keep his business going if he can't actually do the work? So this is really serious stuff, honestly, for you guys. So I need you to really think about it. What do you have in your life? What is your plan? What is your exit strategy to keep you going if something happens? And the reality is something could happen. And I'm, I, I live every day so grateful when I wake up in the morning that I'm still here and I'm able to do the kind of things I'm able to do. This is a big reason why I want to inspire you to really think about this stuff. So I have decided in the last, gosh, just the last few months, I've actually discovered a, an additional streaming of income for myself that makes me super happy, that's make, have, making me have lots and lots of fun. It's helping me with my, my business of helping other people with their businesses, and it just goes together. So I'm having a great time. I'd love to share it with you if you're interested, but I would also just like to help you and talk to you and see if I can guide you in ways to make sure that you have an exit strategy for your business, that you have things set up, that you have uh, income coming in, even if something happens. So anyway, that is my message for today. I need you to take a little bit of time to really look at your life and figure out what you want. The other thing I want you to do to add to that is I want you to sit down and write down every single bit of 
uh, expense that you need to live the life that you want to live. So how much is your rent? How much is your insurance? How much does gas do you put in your car? How much uh, do you spend in groceries? How much do you spend eating out for fun? All of those things. You need to write down every single penny that you need to live every month and then take a look at that and think, are you actually making that much money? And why don't you do it where, where you look at your life the way you want it to be? So maybe you want other things in your life. I want to live somewhere where I can look over the ocean and watch the sunset every night. So I am working on a plan to have what I need to be able to do that. So that is your homework for today. And boy, I've just started this this week for some reason, giving you guys homework. Sit down and figure out what your, the number, exact number of money that, uh, of expenses or money that you need every month to live the life you want to live. And then how are you gonna make sure you have that money every month, especially if something happens that is unexpected. So anyway, I have a couple of events this week. Um, Monday, tomorrow is the uh, 7th, and I'm doing a master, my Monday masterminding. I decided to do it every other week because it's kind of hard for people to get there every week. So tomorrow at the Center for Spiritual Living, which is right next door to Mom Can Cook, my one of my favorite Thai restaurants, you we can grab food from there, and we're just going to mastermind. If you have an idea for business or you have a business and you want to talk about ways to get more clients, um, this is a perfect time to do that because there's no selling, there's no nothing going on. All we're doing is getting together and taking taking turns being in what we call the hot seat and letting everybody help you with your business. One of my favorite, favorite things to do. If you don't have a business, you want to add another stream of income to your business, also come and we can also help brainstorm those kind of things as well. Tomorrow night at 7 p.m. there's a webinar I'm going to be on with my good friend Casey and it's going to talk about how to create raving fans for your business and how to um, create a business for yourself. So really cool stuff tomorrow at 7 p.m. is uh, just go to from mobile to mailbox.com I'll put it in the uh, the link in the chat box um, when I get off of here um, from mobile to mailbox.com just be there at 7 p.m. it's actually an online kind of video conference so you can either be on video or not but you'll be in the room to ask questions and find out about some opportunities and how to grow your business by creating raving fans that's at seven tomorrow. And then if you can come and meet me for lunch and have lunch and have some uh, cool Thai food tomorrow, we're gonna be at uh, the Center for Spiritual Living. It's right over, right by the Canyon Country Post Office um, across on the other side there in the same um, shopping center. And we will be also eating at Mom Can Cook or you can bring your own, whatever you want. That's 11.30 to one. Um, if you can RSVP, that'd be awesome. I think there's a link in the events. Um, it's, there's also a meetup. My meetup is Ignite Your Biz Now meetup group in Santa Clarita. So you can RSVP there. It uh, would be really good to know who's coming. So here you go, your homework. Figure out what your ed exit strategy is. Figure out how much money you need to live every month and how you're gonna do that. And if you need ideas, I am right here offering you free help, free advice. Um, I met someone the other day and she, we were talking about our business and she said, you're just doing this for free? You don't want any money? And I said, no, I wanna talk to you. Now, if you wanna hire me, of course, I, would, I will do that later. But I, the whole point of me meeting with you is to see if I can help you and guide you in the right direction. That's um, my passion and my love. So thank you guys for being here. Hi everyone, uh, Vaughn. Oh, <laughs> you can't remember when you were 43, how funny. I'm, 50, I'm gonna be 55 this month. I am going to be able to order off the senior menu at Coco's. <laughs> Maybe we can all meet there for lunch on my birthday. Anyway, thanks you guys for coming. If you would please put in the chat box, if you watch this live, will you put maybe a one or an L for live and uh, R or a number two for a replay, if you watch the replay. And you know what? It also is good to be held accountable for what you're thinking about doing. So if you want to put down what your exit strategy is or you have questions or need ideas, let's chat. And, um, oh gosh, I keep forgetting to tell you all this stuff. So over here, da, 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 right there, suebrook.com slash free gifts gives you some, some different free webinars and some free tips on how to grow or start a business. Um, just my gift to you. 
And uh, let's see what else. Oh, you can join my Facebook group if you are interested in more business videos and business information resources. Just join my group, Ignite Your Biz Now. There's also a business page for that too. So anyway, have a great day. Go out and have a wonderful Sunday. I'm going to see a friend of mine a little bit later in, in the San Fernando Valley, and um, it's going to be a great day. So you have fun, and I'll talk to you very soon. Bye.